Hi, I'm Michael Ray with the Austin Golf Institute here at Lake Cliff Golf Club just outside Austin, Texas. And today I want to talk about the distance wedges. Now the distance wedges are wedges you're going to hit from about 70 to 120 yards. You're going to find this distance a lot when you're on the golf course. And it's important to use a slightly different technique with the distance wedges than you do with your other iron or approach shots. This is important because we want to control distance, not necessarily maximize distance. So when you think of distance wedge, think of controlled distance. This is, the, this is the concept that we'd like. So here's the changes that you need to make or the modifications in your swing to make yourself a little more consistent in that 70 to 120 yard range. The first thing we're gonna do is we're not gonna take a full backswing like we do with some of the other clubs. We're going to take a three-quarter control backswing where the left arm is about parallel to the ground. The second thing that we're going to do is that in transition, as we start down, all we're going to do is we're going to pressure the lead foot or pressure the left foot if you're right-handed. At that point, all that's left in the golf swing is to rotate the body. And as the body rotates, the arms and hands follow through to a full finish. It should look something like this. This is Michael Ray with the Austin Golf Institute and I hope this has helped your golf game.